exciting day for Pavedal. I'm here with Sean Burke from Avant. Avant equipment, micro equipment, awesome stuff. I'm gonna let Sean explain a little bit about what the benefits, the pros are to this type of equipment. Thank you for having me today, Phil. We always appreciate the opportunity to be able to talk about our equipment. What Avant is, is Avant makes over a dozen articulating compact loaders, most of which have telescoping booms. And what they're known for is having extremely light footprint for their ability for what they can produce and what they can lift and maneuver around a job site. I've had the opportunity to run this machine, but Sean, in your words, you're out there selling the machine, you're doing demos for different contractors. What would you say, like a learning curve or just a, a newbie jumping in the driver's seat, how long does it take them to, to get used to the machine? Sure. Uh, for someone new like that, maybe an hour. Uh, for some, just a few minutes. I mean, it's a pretty simple machine to operate as far as your traveling directions are controlled by pedals on the floor that are forward and reverse. Right. And you have a single joystick that does the, most of the remainder of your functions with some of the other levers right there by your side and easy to get to. I'm just going to add a little bit to that. So I did have the opportunity of jumping on uh, one of these machines for the first time. And I was amazed, really, I've been on equipment all my life, but really just the ease of the forward reverse pedal. And I love just the single joystick. I'm used to running loaders and stuff. So it was, to me, it was a real natural fit and it felt super comfortable. And visibility in the machine being open like it is, it was phenomenal. So some of the greatest advantage of the Avant and what they're really known for is picking up a lot of weight for their own weight in comparison. Every model can pick up roughly about 70 to 75% of its own weight in lifting capacity. That's now that's right. not picking it all the way up and all the way out, but it's picking it up to move your material around the job site. The other advantage is the way that the machine is controlled with the drive motors. Four individual drive motors, uh, hydraulic drive motors, and what that allows for is certain types of steering that are not going to uh, put ruts all over your job site and need to go back and repair and grow some grass and, and do things like that. And also their versatility um, with attachments. Not only do they run their own attachments, but they have the capability to run mini skid steer attachments and full-size skid steer uh, attachments if you already own them. So how many attachments does Avant have? Themselves? So Avant currently offers over 200 attachments themselves, and also there's other attachment makers you know, that we can source in the United States and some other places uh, that have the capability to design attachments for, for the Avant, such as the Optimus. Yeah. It's super impressive. I know I'm, I was looking at your catalog and I just kept flipping and flipping just countless attachments that can couple to this machine and for nearly any industry. So really Absolutely. Impressive. Absolutely. The industry potential is endless. Um, we have a lot of tree guys buying them. We have a lot of municipalities, uh, tent guys, believe it or not, that put up large party tents, uh, hospitals, townhome condo associations, uh, landscaping, obviously hardscaping. You were saying the other day too, even like a um, at the cemeteries, they're using these machines, right? Yes, sir. Very light yeah. footprint. You don't have to worry about tearing up. Nobody wants their grave site torn up. Absolutely. So it's a great fit there. Absolutely. Very Especially cool. with one of your tools that can lift up the headstones and, and place them right. where they need to Set be. Set them with a clamp or whatnot. So I'm going to steal the show here just for a minute. I love hardscapes, <laughs> as you know. So I want to talk about hardscapes and how this machine can benefit our industry. Tremendous machine with different coupler attachments. They have their own patented system for getting into all their attachments. But then they also have a conversion plate that goes to a full skid or even a mini skid steer plate. So it's countless the amount of attachments. So just right off the top of my head, I'm thinking as I look through their catalog, I couldn't believe the amount of attachments, but just simply even behind me, our Vaculift H mini hooked up to the Avant, running off the hydraulics, again, a tube lifter, grabbing large slabs up to 300, uh, 320 pounds, picking up that product set it in place, so that's one unit. They have the jib, which I loved, it's an extension jib. So I'm picturing our clamps, our suction equipment, attached to the end of that. And the neat part about these pieces of equipment, just by turning your steering wheel, you articulate the product out the end of your jib, you can move a tremendous amount of feet, left or right. So to me, that's a great fit for when you start setting these large slabs or treads or something like that, because you're doing it all in one place. And this machine's a great fit for that. I'm thinking you have the backhoe attachment. So if you're digging, this is one machine you're getting again. 
we talked about being a niche piece of equipment, getting in backyards, you got the backhoe, get a breaker um, attachment where you can break up your concrete if you've got demo to do. Obviously the bucket, different, all different size buckets, and the forks. Speaking of the hardscape industry, Phil, as you are aware, your sister company, Baylor Brothers, not only owns one of these units, but two. With a smaller footprint, they don't need to drive as heavy of a truck and a trailer with their light footprint. They're getting in and out of the job sites without additional damage that they're gonna to have to repair later. When they're loading and unloading trucks in the street, they're not burning through tires or tracks with all the turning that they're doing. I wanna elaborate just a little bit on that, and you've made some really good points. Skidding, the skid steer, obviously, you're, you're just tearing up everything in its path. This machine I love because of the way it articulates and maneuvers. Even when you're turning in one place, those wheels turn opposite each other. And so that gives you the ability to move in and out of job without even leaving a footprint behind. So to me, that's a huge benefit. And just with all the benefits of what you can put on the front of this, that's where Baylor Bros are really gravitated to, of having a, one machine that does so many different things, whether it be the hardscape or whether it be just some of the softscapes, doing some of the landscape stuff. They have the augers. So there's just so many, so many benefits. There's one other point that I looked at with this machine. When I'm on a job site and I'm running a machine, next thing you look at the fuel gauge and the thing is already half tank or quarter tank. That's one of my worst pet peeves is getting on a machine and you're just constantly, seems like you're constantly fueling it. One of the things is that we're burning approximately a half a gallon of fuel per hour. Uh, on this particular model, the 528, which does uh, the capabilities of around a 6,000 pound, 60 horsepower skid steer which is burning fuel at a rate of around two and a half gallons. If you add that up with today's fuel prices, you look at over at a 5,000 hour span of life on the machine, you're saving around $35,000. Now, obviously the fuel prices fluctuate, but fuel is always a big cost that has to go into your jobs Absolutely. when considering the estimation and, and all that stuff. Um, as far as the tires go, with the articulation, with the, the four independent drive motors and how they work and how the oil flows to them, you're looking between four and six sets of skid steer tires that you'd be going through compared to one set of Avant tires. So if you add up those, nothing's getting cheaper. Everything's getting more expensive. Your wheels are going to be a little bit more cheaper as well. I'd have to say that's a huge, huge benefit. Absolutely. I got one more tidbit of information I want to add. So when you're using a machine like this, as opposed to bigger, heavier loaders or skid steers, small machine, with a great amount of power and abilities to do your jobs, you don't have to have a CDL license to tote one of these pieces of equipment around. So to me, that's a tremendous benefit. We're obviously all struggling for help in the industry, but if you can put a standard driver behind the wheel, toting this equipment around, get to your job sites, it's a win-win. So Sean, I really appreciate you being here. Thanks for your yeah, time. Thank you very much and well I said. Don't, I don't promote equipment unless I really believe in it. And I can really say with a clean conscience that this is a piece of equipment that is super beneficial to any industry.